Hi, I'm Jason Buck. I work with Remax Estate Properties here in Palos Verdes. Our real estate market is very hot. Homes are sometimes selling in less than a week. Now, you may not have all the time to get to all these homes, but I do. And I shoot a virtual tour to help you save time. Hello, it is September 8th today and I'm in Area 170. Point Vicini Elementary School is just down the street down this way. We have a beautiful home here. This is a four bedroom, three bath with 2,100 feet. Via Rivera is a great street just up from uh, Golden Cove where there's a Starbucks and everything. And this has an awesome view. So we have this little open area here as we come into this property. Here's our entrance. It's got like a slate. And let's go right to the view. Wow, this is awesome. Fireplace in the middle here. Big room here. Uh, you can skim the ceilings, but look at this. This is amazing. Wow. Now this is a view. What an awesome spot. We're looking right down at Point Vicente, all Catalina. You got oceanfront homes down here. Those are all $6 million mansions. You got Santa Barbara Island over there, and you got lots of palm trees. Boy, this is amazing. All right, back into that first family room, living room thing. Fireplace moves around into the kitchen area. This is beautiful. So this property is pretty much original condition, but it's uh, super nice. And uh, I love having a kitchen sink in ocean view. It's just awesome. And then it comes back here into laundry, which is really nice. A little side door to get outside and a half bath. So that's really cool. So, back towards the front door, this floor plan has one room on this side, which would be the master. You do have a raised um, floor here, so there's a uh, raised foundation, so you can get under the house here. And then this is your bath. And then you go through this area here, this bathroom, full tub, and then a couple more rooms over here. You know what? I wouldn't be surprised if there's hardwood under this. I checked, no hardwood, just uh, plywood, but it would be easy to put hardwood down. There's another room. in our third room. All these rooms are really bright. Original windows, cottage cheese. So you got some work to do, but what a great spot. And huge potential. All right, next stop, 2816 Via Anacapa. I'm like right next to Lanata Bay Elementary, just down uh, from PV Drive. This is the southern part where the homes are typically a little bigger um, and it's a lot less traffic on this side. This one's a corner lot, so it's got a huge lot, like over 16 thou. Um, five bedrooms, four bath, and 5,700 feet. A little golf area here, waterfalls and fountains and everything. It's really amazing. All right, here's our entrance, travertine floors. You got a beautiful wrapping staircase up, the chandelier, and that is a gorgeous way. And then there's a gorgeous way out here, but we'll check this first. Here's our living room, very formal, huge drapes. It's got big ceiling. And then we come out here, it goes this way to the outside patio. This wraps around, very nice, over towards the waterfall and such. There's your driveway with your garage on the other side. Moving in here, here's their dining, beautiful travertine floor, LED lighting up above. This moves right on into the kitchen. Very nice kitchen, it's got an island with a cooktop. Look at the faux on the uh, finish work here. Nice. Black granite countertops. This moves on down into your family living room area. Wow, a huge bar here. You get a peak of the ocean out that way, and then outside here there's another bar and a wreck area, patio and everything. Another fountain. Very nice. What a neat big room here for entertaining. And then it works right on outside to this area here. This is beautiful. TV set out there, a nice fireplace, another fountain, more grass. So what a neat spot. 
So this is an elevator. There's another little wet bar area here. Got a half bath here. Access, direct access to your garage and laundry. What an interesting door. I'm not sure if it's metal or not. Big three car garage. And there is one bathroom, bedroom, excuse me, here with its own bathroom. We got air conditioning because it feels really good. It's a hot day here today. Wow, look at that. That's beautiful green. I love that. All right, working our way up the stairs. This is a beautiful staircase. All solid pieces of travertine. It's very nice. So we'll come on up here. It's a bedroom with a pocket door. It's very nice. And then on into the master. We got a little sitting area here. TV, bookshelves. Wow, look at this tub. Nice shower. Vanity sink. Toilet. Big walk-in. Hard to see. Little sitting area and a view deck. Nice. There's the elevator access as well. And we have two other rooms over here. Connected to the balcony, which is nice. Here's the bath. Full shower, tub. Looks like it's in great condition. Nice place. All right, next stop, Via Carrillo, 2424. This is a gorgeous street. If we go down this way, we're right at Lanana Bay Plaza. And uh, over there is Via Zumaya. So great little area in, in lower Lanana Bay. Um, the bedroom here is four, and the bathroom's two. And we're a little over 2,300 feet. We have the gorgeous flagstone stone. Entrance we step in here, we got a little uh, staircase, slate landing, and then bamboo staircase coming up to bamboo floors. Beautiful vault here in this main living room, which is connected to your dining and kitchen. Beautiful. Some gorgeous trees here, giving some shade. And this looks out towards the ocean. Peek through the houses over there and over here. Beautiful work in here. I love the bar top. Nice cabinets. A little workstation over here. Stove, fridge is all same as the cabinets. Into the laundry area, little side door, and then a bath here. Full bath, it's nice. So here we go, looking back. So then they got this room, which could be like a family room next to the kitchen. I guess that could be living. This one has a fireplace, and they have a little outdoor zone here. It's super nice. Well, we might as well go this way. Little path here. And then this runs up the side. We get a couple little outdoor areas up here. Nice. This little patio, hot tub. And then it keeps going. Here's the downstairs grass area. So we were just looking up there at that patio. When it comes into this room. This would be the master. A nice big tub there, that's beautiful. And then we got a shower here as well. Interesting. Double sink. I like that. Another room here. We're using this as an office. And then our final room here. Oh, it's got a loft. Oh, nice little loft up there. And there's one last room. 
Oh, and this has the little lock too. So they just have like a little bed up there. I mean, it's not huge at all, but it's kind of neat. All right, well, neat property. All right, next stop, I'm on the top of Iazumaya, 1400 block, and it's all ocean out there on the other side of the street. You can see the tip of Catalina out there. It's a five bedroom, four bath, over 4,600 feet. Stepping in, tile entrance here, you got dining off to the right. You got a huge living room here. Nice high ceiling. Come into the master here at the fireplace. High ceiling. And then it just comes back here. We've got a closet, closet, tub. Wow, look at that. Shower, double sink. Interesting. Good view. You can see Santa Monica Mountains out that way in the distance. And I saw Catalina over there. I would assume there's more bedrooms over here. Yeah, that goes out to the family room. This is like a den or an office. Looks out onto the pool. Wow, Jack and Jill. You got one room here, you got a double sink in this bath. And full tub. Gorgeous grounds on your pool. There's a lot of room back here. The grass in the back. Pretty neat. There's a wet bar in the family room. Look at the family room, how big it is. Big vault. So you can come in here and taste this up a bit and have a really awesome property. It's a pantry in the kitchen. Nice cupboards. Island. All right, next stop, Via Landetta, 1204, three bedroom, two bath, a little over 1800. Walking on in, slate entrance. You got a room up here. It's got pretty good ocean views. You know, we're in the, right next to Espinosa Circle off the Cornell. There's the edge. Straight through the trees. And here's our main family room. The kitchen in the back. Laundry in here as well. There's our side yard. Go into the backyard. You have raised foundation. Here's your deck outside. A little bit of a hot tub here. A little bit of backyard. In this main room. Come back, we have some bedrooms and a bathroom here, double sink, tile. A couple other rooms here. This one has its own bath. A lot of light in this room. Another look at the yard. And our last room. All right, next stop, I'm on PV Drive North. We're overlooking the golf course. We're in the Eucalyptus. This is beautiful. And we have a four bedroom, two and a half bath with just about 1,800 feet. Look at this, gorgeous oak flooring. And uh, they're doing dining here, which is nice. But you do have direct access down to your garage as well. A lot of storage in two car and your laundry in the garage. Back past the front door, we've got this living room here. It's great. 
There's a fireplace. And a lot of these homes in the Valmonte area have a little patio. Just so pleasant and peaceful and you can keep an eye on your kids while you're playing out there. This room actually has another room off to the other side of it. I'm using it as an office. But it has a little bath as well. Okay. Floors are in great condition and beautiful. We come into this section which has peg and groove. Another fireplace. Another little sitting area next to your kitchen which is so nice. Tile countertops. Stove over here. Glass. Beautiful. Very well done. Opens to the patio as well from here. And we move into the rest of the bedroom wing. That's the heart of the home the This is just a little cabinet area. I thought I'd find laundry, but it's in the garage. This would probably be the master, because it has its own bath. Here are our original windows. A little bit of yard back here. There's a bath. Two other rooms. One. And two. Very nice. All right, beautiful location here. Look at this. Overlooking the Palos Verdes Estates Golf Course. We're at 3701 Via Valmonte. This is right where Valmonte hits Paseo del Campo. Wow. Now, the house, pretty small. It's only a two bedroom. Um, around 1,400 feet or so. Or no, the lot's 14,000. The house is around 2,000 feet. That makes more sense. Nice entrance here with the slate. We have a bath up here in the front. And you have a great big vaulted room. That's really nice. And you got a pretty interesting kitchen here with an island. These are copper countertops. So, double oven. Pretty neat. Definitely great grounds here. You got the fireplace going. Come back to one bedroom back here. Two closets, vaulted ceiling. Comes into the bath here. Could use some updating. You come in and have another large open room here. Bath here. And another bedroom. Very nice. In that main room, we come out to the grounds here. Now this is nice. We've got a pool and a nice yard. There's a hot tub in the back there as well. So that's pretty nice. And you can see there's a lot of room here. So quite a few options here. Neat place. All right, next stop, I'm on Via Arco, our 1401. So we're at the top of the hill. Huge view back here, and this is a huge property. It's just under 6,000 feet at 5907, five bedrooms, four baths, and like an acre. There is a ton of grounds here. Three car garage out front. Pretty amazing. Um, but the view looking through is awesome. So, moving on in, we got dining here and living here, but you come out to here. Oh my gosh, look at this view. Huge view here, you know, all the way around, and then quite a bit of city. And you got a, a ton of lot here. We got almost an acre. There's a pool. There's a tennis court. There's grass. And this is pretty incredible. Pretty incredible. Nice spot. From this front room entrance, they have a room off to this side, the north side of the property. It's a huge, wow, look at that, it's pretty intricate. And that was a full bath there. Um, wow, I mean, so there, looking out this window, is a straight shot at downtown LA, that's kind of neat. So that's Via Cornell, the street there, fountain, balcony, nice. Well, you got 
And there is an upstairs here. So they're probably using this as the master. Wow, and they are. Um, but I'm sure you could have a master downstairs as well. And then look, oh my gosh, downtown LA again. There's the queen's necklace. Wow, pretty amazing. Yep. Pretty hard not to stare at a view like that. It's just so incredible. So, master closet wraps around and around. And then bath. Tub over there, shower over there. All right, interesting layout here for the uh, second room. Interesting. I could use some upgrading. But this beautiful place. Yeah, wow, look at this big hallway. So here we come into the functional area. Got a nice kitchen there. This is a big island with a little bar top. Get your stove and your sink. And a straight shot out at um, downtown LA. We got the lowered fan room, which is nice. So everyone's communal here. Formal dining and a breakfast nook. So we got a laundry here. Bedroom with bath in the back. Did you get the views from upstairs? And then we got an office here. Gosh, great views from the office. Another full bath. Another bedroom. And that's the same office that we saw. We step down into this area. Okay, here we go, pool. We got a full bath there. We got a little room here to take you to the pool area. Maybe a pool changing room, and that goes right onto the hot tub. And then in the back here, we got a rec room. So, a little bit of a wet bar, pool table, and great views. This is a neat property. Thanks a lot for watching. If there's a home that you want to see, please write to me. I'd be happy to show it to you. I have a lot of information that I'd be happy to share. Just give me a call or write me an email. Thanks and make it a great day.